Investments will appear with Minister of Finance. Today, the Uganda Development Corporation officials appeared before Parliament's Trade Committee to furnish them on government's investment portfolio. UDC is the investment wing of the government. The MPs were concerned at the state of government investment in Munyonyo Commonwealth Resort Limited over the exact amount of shares owned on behalf of the public. It's contended that the government shares should be more than 25% worth or about 15 billion shares of the total 60 billion shares. The reasoning is premised on 13 billion shillings of unaccounted for shares government reportedly acquired when it invested in the construction of a marina at Munyonyo. So all this money should have turned into shares. How come you are, you are showing us shares worth 15 billion only? Where is the 13.9 billion going? The representatives of Uganda Development Corporation were short of the answers. We are not yet the shareholders. I cannot give a firm response as to what has happened about the 13.9. 16 years. No, nothing has been remitted to government. You have never had access to Munyonyo. You are in the investment arm of government. How are you going to treat that money we have lost in the past? Chair, I cannot confirm whether there are losses in Munyonyo or not because we have not uh, taken over. In a correspondence dated 22nd October 2021, the Finance Ministry affirmed the transfer of the shares after nearly two years after UDC made the request as okayed by the Solicitor General. The Minister of Finance miraculously transferred the shares two days ago, and uh, this, two days before this meeting, and said the shares are now with the hands, in the hands of UDC. But UDC still claims they have just received the letter and they are yet to receive the documentation. The committee is expected to interface with Mira Investment of the business mogul Sudiro Parelia and the Ministry of Finance. To provide us with a balance sheet so that we can establish if they have not been making profit, if they have been making profit, how much uh, do they owe the government of Uganda? As part of a 36 billion shillings supplementary budget, government recently requested for 1.5 billion shillings to be paid to Munyonyo Commonwealth Resort as part of a debt accrued from the hosting of visitors for the swearing-in of President Museveni early this year. Jackson Onyango, NT.